Last week, uh, the NRW board met in Welshpool and we had a presentation on the progress that we're making towards uh, producing six terrestrial place-based area statements and one marine one for March of next year. This was clearly um, something that was required of us under the Environment Act 2016. And we have worked with individuals, organisations, partners across the whole of Wales over the last couple of years to work out how we're going to produce them and then working with people to get uh, a first cut of what an area statement will look like. Um, so I want to say a huge thank you to everyone who has been involved to date. I've had lots of discussions with organisations who've attended events, individuals who've been involved. Actually, every single one of them has commented on the value of the process. And I think, you know, we are all waiting to see what the outputs are. But I think that people have really found the discussions and the interactions that they've had, both with NRW staff and with other partners and stakeholders during the process, really, really helpful. So from March, we will have the first cut of, of uh, the seven area statements. That's, in a way, the end of the beginning phase. The next phase will be how we all use them. And I would encourage all of you to go on being involved. These will only be as good as we collectively make them. This is not something that NRW can do alone. This needs to be a, a, a collaborative effort. And it is only by all of us buying into the process and the product and then continually using them, improving them, that actually we will get that really good environmental decision making at a place space level. So thank you again and please go on being involved. <laughs>